In the years since the first Academy Award ceremonies in 1929, the organization has bestowed 2,242 statuettes on a worldwide collection of the most distinguished screenwriters, directors, cinematographers, and other artists who have worked in theatrical films. It is a remarkable company. But perhaps the best known and most recognized honorees are the actors. Young and old, men and women, legends and fledglings, they graced our screens and were bound together by a common yet uncommon denominator. They were all, and will be for all time, Oscar winners. In celebration of this year's anniversary, the Academy invited to tonight's ceremonies all those who have been honored with leading, supporting, honorary or juvenile awards for acting over the three score and ten years of Academy history. And I think they're still getting in their places. <laughs> the loudest actors and actresses over the years, ladies and gentlemen, Oscars, family album. Croft, the miracle worker. <laughs> Kathy Bates, misery. <laughs> Ernest Borgnine, Marty. <laughs> Ellen Burstyn, Alice doesn't live here anymore. Red Button, Sayonara. Michael Caine, Anna and her sisters. George Chakiris, West Side Story. Cher, Moonstruck. Julie Christie, darling. Sean Connery, the untouchable. Gina Davis, the accidental tourist. Robert De Niro, the Godfather part two. And Raging Bull. Michael Douglas, Wall Street. Richard Dreyfuss, The Goodbye Girl. Faye Dunaway, Network. Robert Duvall, Tender Mercies. Louise Fletcher, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. Brenda Fricker, My Left Foot. Whoopi Goldberg, Ghost. Cuba Gooding, Jr., Jerry Maguire.
Louis Gossett, Jr., an officer and a gentleman. Lee Grant, Shampoo. Joel Gray, Cabaret. Charlton Heston, Ben-Hur. Dustin Hoffman, Kramer versus Kramer, and Rain Man. Celeste Holm, Gentleman's Agreement. Holly Hunter, The Piano. Angelica Houston, Pritzi's Honor. Timothy Hutton, Ordinary People. Jeremy Irons, Reversal of Fortune. Claude Jarman, Jr., The Yearling. Jennifer Jones, Song of Bernadette. Shirley Jones, Elmer Gantry.